Hello, my wonderful and amiable listeners. Welcome to another interesting news. Lawyers to the Labour Party and its presidential candidate, Peter Obi, on Wednesday clashed with those of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, at the Presidential Election Petition Court in Abuja. It was gathered that the altercation utter, was sequel to claims made by Peter Obi's led counsel, Levi Uzoku, senior advocate of Nigeria, that the Independent National Electoral Commission chairman, Mahmoud Yakub was dodging the service of the subpon- subpona issues issued by the court of for him to produce certain documents. The clash occurred after the Labour Party and Peter Obi's lawyer attended some IRF reports and re- results for about seven states and their local government areas. Izoku told its court that they had wished to conclude standing of documents but that but that they were constrained by the refusal of the Independent National Electoral Commission chairman to receive the subpoena directing him to produce critical documents which they needed to submit as part of the trial. He sued for an adjournment to enable him to resolve the issue with the lead counsel for, independ- for, for the Independent National Electoral Commission, Abubakar Mahmoud, who, according to him, had promised to assist. But Kemi Pinheiro, senior group of Nigeria, who led the Independent National Electoral Commission legal team for one of the proceedings in the Labour Party case, disputed the claims, saying that the in- petitioners are only seeking excuses to ask for adjournment. Penero said similar subpoenas were served on the INEC chairman by the People Democratic Party and it was received without any report of evasion of service. He said it had become a signature tactic of making the Independent National Electoral Commission the whipping boy over the Labour Party's inability to follow through with their case, reminding that the petitioners had only two as only called two out of the 50 witnesses witnesses they had proposed to call, with barely over a week left for them to close their case. The disagreement led to a sharp retort by Peter Obi's lawyer, who took offense with Pinero, saying his use of language was unfair to him. The clash took the intervention of the preceding judge, Justice Aaron Watasamani, to calm the situation as he urged the lawyers to respect the court as they have been eating out at each other. The court adjourned Peter Obi's case until Thursday, June 15, 2023, for continuation. The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, is a Nigeria electoral body which oversees election in Nigeria, and it was established in 1998, shortly after the Nigerian transition from military to civilian rule. The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has encountered several controversies in run-up to elections in the country most notably the April 2007 general election, including criticism about its preparedness for Saeed Abubakar, Sultan of Shokoto, and disputes over its disqualification of Vice President Atiku Abubakar's candidacy. The Supreme Court ruled that the Independent National Electoral Commission cannot disqualify candidates, so Abubakar's name was added to the ballot at the last minute. On the subject of election irregularities, INEC spokesman, 
Annex spokesman Philip Umeadi said on the 19th of April 2007 that we are not sitting on any crisis in Nigeria. The mission of INEC is to serve as an independent and elective election management bodies committed to conduct of free, fair, and credible elections for sustainable democracy in Nigeria. The vision of INEC is to be one of the best election management bodies in the world that meets the aspiration of the Nigerian people. In the build-up in the 2015 general election, INEC, the INEC under Jagas introduced smart card readers for verification of voters and their voting cards to minimize incidents of fraud and rigging. The introduction of card readers was aided by many Nigerians, but a group of four minor political parties who claim to be acting on behalf of 15 political parties kicked against it and urged the Independent National Electoral Commission to suspend the acts. This, the use of card readers in the 2015 election. The 2015 general election were adjourned the most credible, free, and fair election since the return of democracy in 1999. The Independent National Electoral Commission was accused of widespread electoral irregularities in the 2019 presidential election, including cases of ballot paper unavailability smart card readers malfunctioning, and large cancellation of valid votes. The main opposition, People Democratic Party, PDP, and its presidential candidates challenged the results of the election in the courts. The administration of democratic election in Nigeria dates back to the period before independence, when the Electoral Commission of Nigeria, ECN, was inaugurated in 1958 to conduct the 1959 federal election. In December 1995, the military government under the leadership of General Sonori Alabacha established the Nigeria Electoral Commission, on, of, Electoral Commission of Nigeria, which conducted another set of elections. These elected institutions were not inaugurated before the sudden death of Sonia Abacha in June 1998 aborted the process. In 1998, General Abdul Salam Abubakar administration dissolved the National Electoral Commission of Nigeria and established the Independence National Electoral Commission. That will be all for now. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button and let us know your thoughts and your opinion via the comment section below. And I will see you on the next news. Bye for now.